So the FedEx truck just arrived and dropped off something and Rich is so excited. What is it? So today is April 17th and the uh, SpaceX Starship stack did not launch. They had a valve that stuck so they had to scrub the launch but SpaceX still came through for me. Here's our new Starlink. What? Okay, welcome to this Love Sub and Short film. And we are starting our four month trip out west. Yes, and the one thing we need for this whole journey is going to be some internet. So we're gonna try something new. Yeah, so we decided to go the Starlink route. There are other routes such as cell boosters and hotspots and stuff. Mm -hmm. We decided on this because uh, yeah, we just felt that that's gonna give us the best option for being out in the middle of nowhere. Especially that, yes. We're we gonna just, take it out of the box and see if it works. And just see if it works, we'll let you know. And if you're re watching this video, you'll know it worked because we're gonna upload this video using hopefully. our Starlink tonight, yes, hopefully. hopefully. So we'll let's go ahead and take a look. There is one thing that I do love. The you instructions, know, right? Yeah, so Elon Musk, the SpaceX, their recovery ship is called, just read the instructions. Right. And this is it, three pictures. Yes, and he said in a Twitter that it's so easy that all you have to do is plug it in and point it to the sky. So we're gonna see if it's We're gonna easy. plug it in and point it to the sky, see what happens. Absolutely. All right, let's go ahead and set her up. Okay. So we've got our stand. We have Dishy. We're gonna go ahead and plug it in. Put our cord. Not in a lot of parts, right? Nope. Got our router. And we have some wide open sky here, so we should not have a problem getting a signal. And you're just sort of threading it through the middle. Yep. Plugging in the dish. It snaps into place. Yep. I think this will be a good, right about here. All right, so we've plugged it in, we've got it set up. We're gonna go ahead and plug the router in. And uh, we'll leave that outside for now. It's kind of buggy here in New Hampshire. And we haven't gotten a good solution for running the cord inside yet. There's lots of other RV uh, YouTube videos on that. This is what we're gonna do though. Okay. So you just plug the cord into the router and the router into- What do, what do Elon say? He said plug it in and point it- Point at the sky. Okay. So that's what we're gonna do. All right. So one of the things I really love about this is how the design, it's well designed. For example, you can only put this plug in one way because of the angle here of this little piece with the angle here. So there's no guessing like a USB plug, which way it goes. Kind of get that in, and it feels just good. It feels like it clicks into place well. So that's that. We'll get our power cord, which is this. So it comes with two cords, one cord that goes from the satellite dish to the router, and then the plug that goes from the router to the out the plug, right? Yep. Then you need to have the Starlink app, right? Yep, and we've already downloaded that before we left, so. Okay. okay. We're gonna see what happens. It's not doing anything. No, we'll get the app going, see if that helps. Ooh, it's doing Oh, something. it's moving! What? Holy! That's pretty cool. All right, so don't lose faith in Elon Musk. Oh no, we just had to create a our own Network, we, it, it, we didn't do that first, so it got into a weird loop. So now we've created our Wi-Fi network name and Wi-Fi password, and now we're gonna go ahead and connect to that. So you have to have your Wi-Fi and password set up before you start the process? Yep. Okay. So it so says join. So that's it, I think we're in. We're in? Says we're in. Let's do a speed test. All right. All right. I think we're in. Yep. And we're going to do a speed test. Yeah. Before, as she does the speed test, we had to reboot it once. That was the only little glitch. It, it kind of got hung up in the uh, connect phase. Right. And I think it was because we 
um, didn't have our network set, network set up first. And right. we tried to go through the whole thing. And then but we, once we did that, everything sort of yeah, fell into place. Yeah, we just unplugged it, sat five minutes, replugged it, and then everything just went into place and we got completely connected. We're so hooked up. So what was the thing with the map? Because you did something with the map. Yeah, they, they want you to scan the sky to see if you have any obstructions. And we have no obstructions, as you can see, even though it said you may want to find someplace else. I'm like, there's nothing here. So yeah, we nevertheless just said, okay, set up anyway. It's yes. working good. So internet speed 160. Okay. That's and, the... and BPS. Okay. So that was pretty good. Yep. And the upload speed was 11. Okay, so. Which is a little slow, but I, and I think <coughs> what's really neat about the app is it will show you what your speed is and also if you have an outage or an obstruction or anything like that. So right. if it comes in and out, you can actually look at your phone and see what it's going on with it. So it's really kind of a neat thing. Yeah. So um, I think the first time you did a speed test, you got 43 upload, right? Um, well, right now, look, I'm going to redo this, but the first time I get was, no, it was 160 first. Yep. Let me do it again. 160 download. Let's see what, I'm redoing it again. We're going to so. do it again. Why not? Right. Let's see, 140. Okay. So 140 this time around. And uh, let's see. So what I'm getting from this is just the, your connectivity, your speed and stuff will vary. Right, okay. Depending on, we have a visitor. <laughs> let's see, it's slowly, the upload speed's the slowest. It's looking at about 14, 15. 14. Yeah. So that's kind of slow, but hey, we get about 11 at home, so yes. that's gonna work for us. Yes, so that'll be And it's up. better than McDonald's. Absolutely. For three hours uploading a video. Absolutely. So hey, if you like this video. Give us a big thumbs up. And if you think we were a subscription, click the subscribe. And comment below if you've gotten Starlink and how you like it. And we'll be providing some reports later on as to how it continues to go. And we're hopefully gonna upload this video with it. Because we come out with RV and Airstream related short films just like this one every now and then. Thanks for watching.